like YouTube. This is it here. All this, look. See the darkness and the light blue. Darkness, light blue. Well, it's dark because there's something going over us. I'm sick and tired of hearing all this. It's in a different dimension. You can't see it. Gravity's going to knock us out. No, it's not. And it's the magnets. They repel each other. We can't hit each other. We can't, it just doesn't happen, all right? They can't come close. Very close. This close, actually, to be fair. You've got to drop everything you know, or everything you think you know, and start again. Why does it, why does it come down like this? Hey, eh? All the time. Why do you get these weird patterns? Yeah, because what it is, it's an imprint on our clouds of these things up there doing their thing, coming over us all the time. Or you can believe that they're this big, like some channels want you to believe, there's a pretty thing around the sun. Or you can believe they're out by Jupiter, like other channels. Yeah, or you can go and listen to Eric Briggs, the science bit. Go and have a look at Sam Hoffman, these amazing drawings that he do. Between the two of them, they've pretty much got it right. Yeah. Hmm. I wish you could see what I see. All my eyes fucking see all the time. I feel like I live in a sci-fi movie. up from the southwest goes over to the northeast it's the best way to see it and if you really want to see it the best way the best way to see it and I'm not being an arse when I say this or anything patience you've got to go outside or watch watch the sky you're looking south there south east west is over here so sort of like more southeast there really That these days, patience seems to have lost that, seems to have lost the ability to sit and watch or to observe, be quiet, try and learn, try and learn something. Everyone just wants it now, I want it now. Anyway, just wanted to address that quickly, just quick. Moving. I feel the entire sky. The entire sky. I'm not gonna leave it. Oh, awesome. Peace.